In the Dynamics 365 for Sales Hub, you can now update your system to use the enhanced email experience. This update reached general availability last month, and in this video, I'm going to show you how you can set it up. But first, why should you use the enhanced email experience over the standard traditional one? Well, it comes with some pretty neat benefits. First of which, and best of which, you can navigate to different pages within your app without losing your email content. Second, you can minimize the email window at any point and go back to other records that you were working on. Third, you can expand the email editor pop-up window and see more email options. Fourth, well, you can simultaneously open up to three email compose pop-up windows at any given moment. Fifth, you can search for and apply a template to an email that you're currently composing, which is pretty cool. And finally, you can insert attachments. So what about the rules? Well, there's one really important one that you should be aware of. This only works with email activities that are created within a timeline section of a Dynamics record in any Dynamics 365 for customer engagement app. So now that we've talked about what it is, why it's cool, and some of the rules, let's dive in and I'll show you how to configure it in your system. We're gonna take a look at this in my test environment, and this is a sales hub. So let's go to sales, and we're gonna to navigate to app settings. Once this loads in the site map, we're gonna stick with overview, which is where it landed. And under this productivity tools, we see enhanced email for timeline. So all we have to do here is click manage, and it's as simple as toggling this from off to on. Click save and boom, enhanced email for timeline has been achieved. So let's see this in action. Here is a contact in my system, Carly Yates. We're going to go to the timeline and add an email. Now you can see immediately, it's no longer opening up its own record that takes up the whole screen. I've got this little pop-up window here. Just like before, it pre-populates my to and from, but if I scroll down to the actual email body, look at all of the enhanced abilities to create your email. So at the top, you can attach a file directly from here. You can insert your template, insert a signature. You can launch a flow directly from here. Lots of cool things. I think this is really neat. I've already turned it on for my environment and hopefully this video will help you turn it on for yours.